I'm Deacon Danny with Christ the King School and Church. Peace be with you. Be merciful, just as your Father is merciful. Stop judging, and you will not be judged. Stop condemning, and you will not be condemned. Luke 6, verses 36 through 37. If you've ever been in a conversation with someone regarding right and wrong, moral behavior, and they do not want to have a certain behavior corrected, this is the scripture that is often volleyed back in any Bible-believing Christian. It seems pretty clear, yet just a couple of verses later, Jesus pretty much tells us to judge outward behavior. Jesus says, a good tree does not bear rotten fruit, nor does a rotten tree bear good fruit. For every tree is known by its fruit. A good person out of the store of goodness in his heart produces good, but an evil person out of the store of evil produces evil. For from the fullness of the heart, the mouth speaks. Luke 6, 43 through 45. Again, a couple of chapters later, Jesus explicitly tells his disciples to judge by saying, why do you not judge for yourselves what is right? Luke 12, 57. In the Gospel of John, Jesus says, stop judging by appearances, but judge justly. John 7, 24. So Jesus says quite a bit about judging. It seems to me that as human persons, we constantly judge things and people as good or bad, right or wrong, as good, true, or beautiful. We have been made with immortal souls, which includes a desire for what is beautiful, true, and good. Therefore, we cannot not judge. Jesus is inviting us, his disciples, to judge by his standards rather than the world's standards. Take some time today and visit with Jesus about how you judge, what can be celebrated, what needs to be transformed by his grace. Let's pray for one another. God bless.